So I, I really think that the people who are identifying, for example, with Russell Wilson, uh, in, in that particular example, I feel like those are people who aren't really comfortable with affection themselves. And from an outside perspective, if you aren't comfortable with doing something like just basic displays of affection with your woman, I feel like that's some someone who you should feel safe and comfortable to do things like that with. And I feel like that's an honest reflection because if you are, if that's the mother of your child, because they do have a child together, they're together, they're married, that's a large source of happiness and joy in your life. Not, I understand that a relationship shouldn't be the, the sole focus of happiness, but it, that it is a source which people do derive that from, that joy. And admitting that you're afraid of losing that, so you're, you're, you're behaving in a way that you're not jeopardizing that. I don't think there's anything innately wrong with that. We should be afraid of certain things. Like we, it, that governs the way we behave because we try to act to preserve things. And then the other part about him being a son because he married a woman that had a child with another man. I think that I disagree with that. I mean, it's not for everyone for sure. But just, I mean, I, I feel like that's a very foolish statement to assume that because somebody has a child from a, a previous relationship that you're a simp or you're you're downgrading because the definition of like what we saw with the simp, it says without a female bringing anything to the table. And one of these things about these celebrity relationships, we know very little about what these people actually bring to the table. And so I'm more concerned with the commentary and the thoughts and the ideas of the people more so than the actual individuals that it's being directed towards.